consistently for last many years. If you see Python, then Python has use case in various domains of software. Carry on my learning in Python or let's say I can start my learning in Python. That is more application driven. That is more, I would say, interesting and gives you some important outcomes after your learning. It gives you a very interactive way in which you can actually learn Python, right? It has a dedicated track around Python programming fundamentals. A lot of times students actually face a lot of difficulties and waste a lot of time in doing the local project and the code setup because of the varied operating systems and the machine configuration people actually get stuck a lot see you don't want to be stuck into just setting up things because you want to learn fast then make things fast break things fast and fix things fast how i started learning python i had learned python in school right in my 11th and 12th class that was the time when i was introduced with python you can start with the basics of python start some really basic coding with python then do some problem solving around python and then also try to explore some application driven development like maybe some backend development tracks or let's say some machine learning tracks altogether who has just started to think about learning python or let's say you are already learning python then trust me on this, you are already on the right track to become a successful software engineer, data scientist, machine learning engineer and whatnot. All because of the fact that Python is one of those languages which is one of the most, which has a lot of demand as of now in the industry. Python easily ranks itself in the top three programming languages consistently for last many years. If you see Python, then Python has use case in various domains of software. You think about proper, let's say, backend development, data engineering, machine learning, data scientist, data analysis, and whatnot, right? Everywhere you will see the dominance of Python, you will see applications of Python. The overall ecosystem of Python is very much well developed. And because of all of this, you will find that there are thousands of open roles in different, different companies, varying from small startups, mid-sized startups, to even big MNCs altogether that are actually using Python. Just to name a few, if you see companies like Google, if you see companies like Uber, right, Microsoft and whatnot, all of these companies have one or more than one use cases in which they heavily rely on the stack of Python. Now, a question can technically come to your mind is that if now, let's say I have decided to learn Python or let's say I'm already learning Python, then is there any structured way or any effective way in which I can carry on my learning in Python or let's say I can start my learning in Python that is more application driven that is more I would say interesting and gives you some important outcomes after your learning then don't worry this video is going to be for you in this particular video I'm going to technically talk about that what is one of the best resources to actually learn Python in one of the most structured and one of the most interesting ways altogether thanks uh, to data camp also to sponsor this particular video and we are going to talk about data camp in a moment now if you want to actually learn python of course there are multiple ways there are so many big youtube playlists that you can actually binge watch altogether or maybe there are a lot of books that you can maybe read 400 500 pages pretty fat and big books right this is also one way in which you can actually learn python but i would like to specifically mention data camp here now data camp is one of the most interesting platform if you want to learn things like python python related development machine learning deep learning and whatnot right it gives you a very interactive way in which you can actually learn python right it has a dedicated track around python programming fundamentals in which you will be able to run things like how to actually write basic hello world starting from very basic and beginner level of writing let's say hello world in python to a few interesting concepts like how exactly variables and data types are actually stored what are functions how exactly functions empowers a lot of things in python right object oriented principles in python like how exactly classes and objects actually work and all of this learning is going to happen in a very interactive and a project driven way right what Whatever you are going to learn, you are actually going to implement that in small, simple, sometimes even bigger projects also, so that you don't just learn the concepts, you are able to actually see where you can apply those. This application driven, I would say development learning is something that I really promote altogether and data camp actually is going to help you a lot in that. Now, just for an interesting fact. I also own a subscription with data camp, right? I spend a lot of time with data camp to actually learn concepts around machine learning, deep learning and all. And it has become one of the most interesting ways for me to also enhance my learning, right? 
the best thing that i find in data camp is that you can directly code into your browser a lot of time students actually face a lot of difficulties and waste a lot of time in doing the local project and the code setup right because of the varied operating systems and the machine configuration people actually get stuck a lot now because of data camp you don't have to go to all of that hassle you can just directly open up your browser and code everything in your browser and the overall coding environment integrated in data camp is going to give you instant feedbacks where you are actually making mistakes what are the things that you can improve and it is going to give you instant uh, results on whatever code you are going to technically execute this actually makes the learning slightly a bit more faster and fun see you don't want to be stuck into just setting up things because you want to learn fast then make things fast break things fast and fix things fast right and if you want to continue a cycle like this platform like data camp is going to be a one shot solution for you also not just the python track there are so many different different interesting tracks on which you can actually start your learning and the best part is that once you complete a track you are going to also be awarded with a certificate that you can definitely put in your let's say linkedin resume and in whatever companies let's say certificates do matter you can actually show off that uh, you actually learned these skills from a certain platform which is globally recognized and your skills and your overall credibility is also going to increase right there are definitely a few but some companies who do actually consider these kind of uh, certificates that you are going to earn and once you complete any track you are going to be awarded with this kind of certificate so it actually gives you kind of like a rewarding mechanism as well that you have some goal at the end that okay once you complete a track you will be actually rewarded with something so this keeps you in the loop right this keeps you inside that rewarding loop that okay if i will complete this i will be uh, rewarded with something right because of this you don't lose a track that is definitely very very important right and honestly like uh, how i started learning python i had learned python in school right in my 11th and 12th class that was the time when i was introduced with python trust me a uh, like platform like data camp would have increased my learning like 10x or 50x at that point of time if i would have been uh, like introduced to a platform like that or maybe a platform like that increase like existed in let's say 2012 or 13 so this is going to be a game changer for you and the best part is you can actually start learning for free at data camp you can try to enroll in any of the corresponding tracks and see whether it suits to you or suits your learning style or not you can do some hands on there are few free, free exercises there are few free lessons available on the data camp platform you can go there sign up and you will trust me fall in love with the overall coding environment and the development environment altogether that is integrated inside data camp so all you have to do just check out the link in the description section below and you will be redirected to data camp start your learning of python through data camp right you will get all the structured resources there you can start with the basics of python start some really basic coding with python then do some problem solving around python and then also try to explore some application driven development like maybe some back end development tracks or let's say some machine learning tracks all together right this is going to be one hell of a ride and you are going to definitely enjoy it all together so do check out data camp the link is in the description section below and if you like this video then don't forget to hit the like button and do subscribe to the channel so that you can get all the latest updates and thanks again for data camp to sponsor this particular video and help our channel to grow as well that being said let's wrap this particular video here and we are going to meet soon in the next set of videos where we are going to continue our discussion on tech and career till then take care bye bye i am sanket singh signing off